Tonight, the CDC is warning of a deadly listeria outbreak linked to fruit in seven states, including Illinois. Ten people have been hospitalized and one person has died after eating peaches, nectarines and plums. The recalled fruit from HMC Farms was sold between May and November 15th. Check your fridge and freezer, throw it out and clean the area where it was stored. That listeria outbreak is just one example of contaminated foods. It's estimated there are about 48 million cases of foodborne illnesses every year. Some of the foods on Consumer Reports list of risky foods may surprise you. CBS's Janet Shamlian has some simple steps to stay healthy. I don't want to get sick. A case of food poisoning turned Megan Alardi into a cautious shopper. I got so violently ill, it was frightening. Like, is that when you became yes. more concerned about your food? Way more, way more concerned. Now Alardi buys hydroponic lettuce from Tom's Market in Warrenville, Illinois. Greens grown in water instead of soil. Why do you buy hydroponic lettuce? I buy it because it is grown in a controlled environment. I like it. There's no pesticides added. There's not a million people touching it and messing with it. Ilardi used to buy leafy greens and bagged lettuce. Number one on Consumer Reports 10 Risky Recalled Foods list, linked to illness, outbreaks, and recalls. All of these foods can be contaminated with dangerous bacteria like Listeria, E. coli, and Salmonella. Food microbiologist Sana Mujahid took us behind the scenes at Consumer Reports. So bag lettuce has been through a lot of steps uh, before it gets to you. It's grown on the field, it's taken to a processing plant, it's cut up, it's bagged. So there are a lot of chances for contamination. The same applies to pre-cut fruit. You should buy it and then cut it yourself. Also on the list, cheese and deli meat, ground beef, onions, turkey and chicken, papaya, peaches, melon and flour. If a melon's rind is in contact with contaminated irrigation water when cut, it can transfer to the fruit. Experts say to avoid bruised onions and produce because bacteria can enter and cause gastrointestinal issues. For the immunocompromised, the consequences can be serious. More than 3,000 die from foodborne illness every year. It's important to follow good food safety practices. Hello. To reduce risk, you don't have to give up these foods. Experts say just be aware of recalls and prepare with care. Have a good day. Janet Shamley and CBS News. Warrenville, Illinois.